G'day guys, Mark here, my Dravar Auto Electrical and DC Auto Fitouts. If you haven't guessed, I'm sitting inside a brand new Troopy 79 series. Why am I sitting here? Because I'm going to show you what we've done with a slimline battery and where we've fitted it. Five seater model. So it's got the back row here. Customer obviously wanted the back row, he wouldn't have bought it otherwise. So we've come up with a solution to save having to put the battery under the bonnet. Now if we cut through to the bonnet, now in the V8 cruisers, once they went to ABS, to get a second battery, and we do have to relocate all this stuff in here. So you got your injector drivers, a bit of wiring harness, and it is extremely tight fit in there. Makes it very hard to get in, get all the stuff in and get out and to do maintenance further on down the track. So that's one of the reasons why we chose not to put it in here. Also, we avoid under, under bonnet temperature heat affecting battery life also. so. Let's go back through to the back and I'll show you how we've done it. Now, in the video last week, I showed you a couple of options. So we've utilized the, the slimline 150 amp AGM in this one, mount it nice and underneath the seat. I'll just roll the seat forward. And then we have it fully in-housed, encased in an aluminium box. So he can still load gear up in here, doesn't have to worry about shorting anything out, the battery damaging anything. Everything's housed inside that, the battery. We do have the Red Arc DC-DC converter mounted off to the side there where we can still see its operation. And in short, just makes a nice, neat, simple install. So thanks for watching.